Dave here for ReadyMade RC, and we're checking out the Ladybird Custom FPV setup. This is going to use the ReadyMade RC Pico Wide camera, a very small Pico transmitter, 900 megahertz in this case, the 5 volt regulator, and it's going to be running off of a 1S battery that we've wired up. Kevin is our Ladybird Custom FPV pilot, and he's going to be flying off of the new ReadyMade RC 12 inch monitor and a 900 megahertz receiver. While it's a small and lightweight craft, the Ladybird can carry this Pico setup no problem and really shows its agility and ability to move through very tight and confined spaces. This is an industrial building with pretty thick walls and reflective surfaces everywhere. Those are contributing to the flashing you're seeing on screen, which is known as multipathing. And moving from room to room, the antenna are simply being blocked by the walls, leading to a little bit more degradation on the link. Even with some of the video link degradation, it's still a lot of fun to fly and really do things that you've never been able to do indoors with an FPV setup. The frequency options down to 900, 1.2, covering 1258 and 1280, really gives some flexibility to these systems and for most people who might already have an FPV system, an easy addition. Adding this FPV setup to the Ladybird is also quite easy from a build perspective. Using the Pico camera, the Pico transmitter, and a little 5 volt regulator, you simply connect it to a 1S battery, make a little adjustment so that it'll work, fit the extra gear onto the Ladybird, and you're good to go. The flight times can range from 5 to 6 minutes, maybe more, depending on how you're flying and what size battery you end up using. Setting up a micro base system like this in FPV really adds to the fun and can set you up for year round flying, course making, competitions, indoor clubs, all types of exciting stuff with FPV. Here Kevin's showing off some of his skill sets running basically every inch of the warehouse. Filming, flying, daring himself, and conquering basically any open space in the warehouse that really we've never seen from an FPV perspective. You simply can't run a camera around like this without having such a cool little micro setup as we've got going with the Ladybird here. Passing through boxes and small holes is really easy to do. And Kevin, while he's a good pilot, is really showing what can be done by a lot of people. The system we're showing here is on the Ladybird, but the reality is this micro setup can be adapted to a number of different platforms, from fixed wing to multi-rotor, and even ground vehicles. This flexible and low-cost FPV solution is really going to expand the options and creativity that we see from projects and builds out there, and we're really excited to bring this Pico setup to the indoors and even outdoors on a range of FPV setups. So head on over to ReadyMadeRC.com and check out some of the options we've got for the Pico camera and Pico setups. Thanks for watching.